Hi, 안녕하세요. How are you? Um, today I'm making some banchan. So banchan means side dish in Korean. And a lot of my friends here, they, they ask me for videos of my favorite banchan. And this is probably my most favorite one, um, featuring potatoes and meat and fries. Like who doesn't like them? So let's get to this. And we're gonna make some gamja bokkum. So these are the ingredients. The, the really most important ingredients are potatoes and onions. And I'm adding leeks also for better flavor. And these are the colorful ones like red bell peppers and a um, little bit of carrots. I'm adding some ham for more flavor, but you can make it totally vegetarian by not adding any ham at all. And of course, I love mushrooms. So potatoes and onions, let me show you how to cut. When I slice these, because because I want all the shapes to look like this uh, matchstick form. So when I slice, I try to slice without, oop, without doing this, like this. These onions are so small, so cute. Usually I use a lot bigger ones. So something like this. So you leave them like this, that way, um, it doesn't make us cry. Nothing for bacon, even though he's been very naughty. Okay, so for potatoes, let me use the other um, cutting board. For potatoes, let me show you how to... Uh, bacon! How to make it very easy, how to slice very easily. So I'm going to slice... I, I already sliced off the edge a little bit, so it's easier to just secure on top of the... Um, cutting board here then from here you can just make them into a little matchstick shape then to get rid of the starch because I don't want these to um, get stuck on a pan I'm going to rinse in the water a little bit that makes it so much easier to fry later You don't have to um, soak very long. Even just the light rinse for a couple minutes or soak, that is totally fine. Now I'm making it very uh, thin so it cooks fast. Since I'm going to fry a lot of vegetables here. Bacon's getting so excited. But you already stole ham! So bad, Bacon. like this and you just need to rinse very quickly then um, strain and then you're ready to fry these so this was about 500 grams so a little bit over uh, more than one pound of potatoes all cut like this and rinsed and strained so I'm going to uh, use this one but first let's you let's start to fry the ingredients that really give us the most flavor which is this and onions. Bacon was ham so bad. I'm going to add just a little bit of salt. Just a little bit. And let's add the rest of the ingredients. I will add the ham very last. And potato. I like using this uh, big skillet so you don't lose the ingredients. So I've been stir frying this for about seven, eight minutes, and I think they're about 
I would say like 80% done. So now I'm going to season. So you season kind of late and you can see it's pretty easy going with the bottom of the pan because I already washed the potato and so not a whole lot of starch got stuck at the bottom. And let's add the hand pulp. And if you like spicy food like me, you can put this peppers. Um, like it's, a, it's a jalapeno pepper and today I'm gonna make it mild, but usually, usually I make it very spicy. So let's season it. Today I'm going to use fish sauce. You could use just salt and pepper only, but I tend to use a little bit of fish sauce that makes it very tasty. So let's put just a little bit, very little bit like this. Probably was about half tablespoon. And the rest of the, the salty paste I need, it's going to come from just salt. Now the last ingredient is um, turmeric, I forgot what it was called. You can use curry powder also, I couldn't find it um, just now. So I'm just going to use a little bit of, um, I'll say this is about half teaspoon of turmeric. And it makes it very pretty and I love the flavor of turmeric, very healthy. So once it's pretty well mixed, I'll say it's almost done. So it's almost done, but I want potatoes to get softer. So I'm going to turn off the heat. Turn off the heat and cover a little bit. And let it sit for just a few minutes and it'll be perfect for eating. All right, so it's all done and we're going to take... So bacon already sampled ham before I started cooking, but for working with me, I'll give him a little more ham. Bacon, you get ham. So let me just taste. I'm so hungry right now. And so I'm gonna eat some pepper, mushroom, and potato. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. So good. And not the junkiest food either. You know, it has enough good vegetables that it's not just potato fries. Mm. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and actually make it at home. Bye!